Hello, this is Brian Fingerson. Um, this is a quick video I made as part of my homework submission for my Digital Logic course because uh, after doing the problems and the simulations, I felt that wasn't quite enough, so I built an H1 multiplexer in Minecraft. And this is it right here. So, over here I have four inputs. Um, over here I have another four colored inputs. These eight are going to be my data inputs. Uh, my selection inputs are, I have three right here, and I have signs which correspond to which data input they'll select. Uh, over here I have my um, screen for an output, which will go on and show what state the multiplexer is in. If we want to look at the circuit, I'll go over here. Um, this is one side of it. I built this multiplexer using two 4 to 1s and one 2 to 1. 2 to 1's right there, and then one 4 to 1 there, one 4 to 1 on this side. Uh, it uses AND gates, which look like this right here. Uh, OR gates, which look like this right here. It's basically just wired directly connected. And also NOT gates, which look like this one right here. So you can see 0 goes in, 1 comes out. Now I'll give a brief demonstration of this multiplexer. So I'll use the red input to test it. And go over to my selectors. This says it should be down. This one says it should be down as well. And then this one should be up. So if I flip the switch, the output goes on. Flip back, then it goes off. Of course, if I change any of these inputs, the multiplexer will not change or remain off. I'll do one more demonstration with the teal right here. And this one should be down, which it is. This one should be up. And this one should be up. So I'll flip the switch. And boom, goes on. Once again, this is my 8 to 1 multiplexer built in Minecraft. So I hope you enjoyed the video.